Hello and welcome. In this video, I will talk you through how to find and install the MG iSmart application on your phone, but also if you just bought an MG4, how to find it in your infotainment system for both the SE and Trophy versions. So let's get into it. If you want to see the best and latest offers, simply search for luscomotors.co.uk and select the brand you prefer. We continuously update our offers to ensure that you get the best deal on any new or used car. Right, so let's first see how you can find and then download the application onto your phone. If you have an iPhone, go into your App Store, and if you have an Android phone, go into your Play Store. Within the search button, type MG iSmart. Select the application and then click open or download. As soon as it is downloaded, open the application and you will be introduced with the loading page of MG iSmart. Then scroll to the right and click start. You, you are now in the main dashboard of the MG iSmart application, but first we need to register. To do that, on the top left hand side corner, you will see three lines which indicate the menu, um, the menu button. Click on that and you will find sign in and register buttons. Click on the register. In order to register, you can do it in two ways, either by your mobile phone or with your email. So let's start with the mobile phone. If you're in the UK, please select the plus 44 code. And when you input your mobile number, please do not start with zero. Otherwise it will not work. For example, start with 774XXX. Then click on send verification and the verification code will come onto your mobile phone. Input the verification code and then create your password. It's as simple as that. Now, if you want to register via your email, simply select email and then follow exactly the same process. Input your email, input the verification code and then create a password. And now you're ready to pair with the cup. Since we're at this stage, I will now show you how you can find the MG iSmart application on your new MG4 EV main infotainment system. So let's get into that. So we are currently in the MG4 EV SE model. There's two ways to find the bind vehicle setting for the SE version. Let me show you the first one, which is <clears throat> on the right hand side, you will see the settings button. Please click there. And here in the middle, we can see all the, all the different settings we can, we can play with. Just scroll down and you will see the bind vehicle as the very last option. Click there and then click in the middle, bind vehicle. You will be presented with the MG iSmart screen and then click bind vehicle where you're presented with a QR code. So now assuming we have registered and you have your phone on your hand, simply scroll this lock button to the left hand side and select bind now to allow your camera to bind the vehicle and it's as simple as that the second way to find the bind vehicle if we go back into our main screen is to simply scroll to the left hand side and again go into settings bind vehicle and follow exactly the same process so this is how you find the bind vehicle option for the se version of the mg4 now let's jump into the trophy model and just like that we're now into the mg4 trophy so let me show you how you can pair your phone with um with the, with, with the car there's only one way of on the trophy unlike the se so simply scroll to the left from your main navigation and find user click on user and immediately we're going to the mgi smart and you have your qr code as we've done on the SC version, simply take your phone out, go into the MGI Smart application, and then from the main screen, click the unlock button and um, use your camera to scan the QR code and the car will automatically pair with your phone. And that's pretty much the process. And this concludes our quick video guide about the MGI Smart application on the MG4. I have a link up there on the video now for a full video review of the MGI Smart application. So if you're interested on that, click there. Also, if you want to see a full review of the MGI Smart specifically for the MG4, please let me know down in the comment section. 
I hope you have found this video useful and informative. If you did, please leave us a like and a comment. Thank you ever so much and I hope to see you on the next one. Buying a new MG or Suzuki? Then head to luscommotors.co.uk and my team will help you find the best deals in the UK. And remember, we won't sell you a car, but we will help you buy one.